Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome to day 23 of the I Quit Smoking Challenge. I am Sir Venom Mike A. And we'll get to some good stuff right after this. Hey everybody, like I said, man, I am Sir Venom IK and welcome to day number 23. I just woke up, the time is 8.30 in the morning. Now, after that last video, that last video went up probably about 4 o'clock in the morning. I have slept for a little bit. 8.15, I rolled right out of bed. Don't you hate it when that happens? God knows I do. Let's have that morning vape. Mm. Yo, let me tell you something, boys. We are tonight, this morning, we are still vaping on the King Cake from Vape Wild. Fucking awesome. I filled it up like three or four times. Uh, <coughs> was well, something good that, that has come out of uh, me getting a new mod and doing, uh, doing well on this mod as we're up to 23 days without a cigarette um, is that that's it. That's the whole mod, man. It, it fits in the length of your hand and... The, and it, it, it's it's pretty invisible. Uh, there's a couple of downsides that I have seen to this after using this thing uh, since we got it a couple of days ago. Uh, number one, your air hole. It's a double-sided air hole. So to get both air holes out, you have to turn. So it's a little, the tank sits a little loose in the threads. Okay. Now if I go ahead and tighten this down to where the air hole is right there minor difference but you can you can tell when you you can tell that it's not getting as much airflow but it's like very minor it's a minor tell like the difference between this and having it open on both sides here is very very small it's slim but it is noticeable so if you guys are looking for something like this uh, uh, something really small uh, that puts out a good vape or you're trying to travel with it this is a very good option if you're looking for a big heavy hitter or, or whatever cloud chaser this is not your option to go uh, number one you're not going to get uh, a tank on this thing other than the one that comes with it or one that's 16 and a half millimeters wide uh, this is the, like I said, this is the Shadow shadow uh, Tank Mini. And it's a good tank. The coils are 0 .6, and they only come in 0 .6. So if you guys are looking for even bigger vapes to push that wattage on this tank, or this this mod, this is not this is not the mod for you, boys. This is not a mod for you. But if you are a beginner like myself, this tank is just fine. You're going to refill it quite a bit. But other than that, I'll, I'll fill it up every once in a while. And, you, and for the price point... 20 bucks, 1887 from VaporBeast.com, where I got it from. Not too bad. We are vaping, like I said, on the King Cake, and I've, I've decided to make my uh, change my little idea here about what this tastes like. Number one, it tastes exactly like the ones that you would go through. Oh, uh, that's uh, VapeWild.com. VapeWild.com. <sighs> Still sad that y'all didn't ask me to marry y'all. <sighs> but I'll get over it. Uh, but either way, boys, um, it's a great mod. It's a great juice, but uh, I've changed my mind, and I think I like it. Uh, I really, really like the King Cake. If you guys haven't tried it, man, I think they were they gave it to me. I don't know if they were giving it out to everybody, uh, but uh, try it, man. It's pre-steeped. That way, if you do make an order and they do send you a 30-milliliter bottle of this, you can vape on this until your stuff finishes steeping. Uh but uh, here's my flavor, uh, my flavor report. And now for the flavor report with Sir Venom. All right, I'm still getting that glazy, the real overbearing glazy, and that's great. I love it. Uh, I am getting a very sweet. Um, 
I, you know, I said yesterday that it was cinnamon, but I'm not sure if cinnamon goes in these things. Uh, it's more of a honey bunny type of flavor. The, not the actual bread itself, uh, but there is some in there, and I'll talk about that here in a second. But uh, the the little grains on the inside of the honey bun, that's kind of what it tastes like. And then uh, when when you get these in the store, when you get a king cake in the store. Uh, there's an overwhelming bready flavor to it, and I'm not a big fan of it because I'm not really a big fan of overwhelmingly bready flavors. Uh, but it's a very mild bread on the very, very end of this. And I don't know how they mix it. If it's freaking the, the glaze is up here, and then they got this cinnamony type flavor here, and then the bread is like way down toward the end. And it's not overbearing, and it's not, it's good. It's flat good. So, guys, check it out. King Cake, go get you a bottle, vapewild.com. <sighs> tell them Sir Venom sent you. You won't get nothing for it, but tell them I sent you anyway, because we're awesome people. All right. So, let's see. How do I feel this morning? <laughs> Well, I've already vaped today, so uh, maybe I should have done the breathe before that. But other than that, man, I feel pretty fucking good. Uh, my wife is smoking, and since uh, I've gone from smoking or uh, vaping, I keep calling it smoking, but I've gone from vaping a 12 milligram down to a 3 milligram uh, over like le legitimately from one tank to the next tank. And I think I filled this up twice and I filled up the peppermint once. So, uh, I'm hitting it a lot. Uh, and that's because my body's used to more nicotine and I can, I, I don't mind doing that. I don't mind doing that. It tastes good. I'm probably going to burn out my coil over the next couple of days, but that's okay because uh, there's some companies out there that have them for pretty cheap. And I think uh, last time I looked, it was $10 for a five pack of coils of these, a five pack of coils. And you can see, we can open up this one and I'll, I'll show you this, this thing. And it's a really good tank. I mean, it's, it's a really good coil. I, I like it. it. It doesn't get hot. Uh, as you can see, there you go. Big, nice uh, wicking there. And uh, the juice slots, man. The juice slots are freaking outrageous. So, uh, But it's, it's a good... Uh, it's a good little coil. You just prime it up, let it sit for about 10 minutes, and you're good to go, just like you're pretty much the rest of the coils. Um, I have found something here uh, about this tank that uh, it does t tend, like down here in the, in where the coil is, it does tend to get a little warm after you hit it for, oh, say, five or six seconds. It, it gets a little hot, uh, but I, I, I assume that's normal. If I'm wrong, let me know. Um, uh, another another thing that I've noticed is that uh, this tank works better if it's wide open. If it's wide open, uh, the vape is very cool if it's wide open and you hit it like this. It's a very cool vape. Now, if you close off the airflow a little bit, or well, I'm just going to say close off the airflow, but if you like half hit it, it tends to get a little, ooh, there was a little more in there than I had anticipated. It does tend to get a little warm. Uh, so my suggestion, if you're new, even if you're new and you're still looking for that cigarette hit, close it off about halfway and you'll get, you'll get a decent cigarette feel, uh, mouth to lung. You can do mouth to lung on this. Uh, I still recommend it wide open and then take as deep breath as you can handle. And, uh, it'll keep, it'll keep the vape cool and probably won't burn the back of your throat. So that's it for me. I love you. Day 23 is on the way. Here's hoping that you guys have a wonderful day, and uh, I have well, a little a little awesome thing coming up uh, Saturday over here at, uh, you guys can follow me on the Twitter at Sir underscore Venom underscore IK, or y'all can head over to Twitch at twitch.tv slash Sir Venom IK. This weekend is a special weekend. It is the Supremacy League World of Warships Finals. I will be casting the bronze medal match with my casting partner, Mr. Swole PT. Uh, we they in Supremacy League. If you guys don't know what the Supremacy League is, this is competition that is the highest level of competition for World of Warships. Now, it's not an E League. It's not like League of Legends. It's not big like that. It's a small, 
It's a small community. There's about 15 teams in the in the gold division and the silver division, and uh, we're gonna cast the uh, we're gonna cast the uh, bronze league, and that will start up on my channel about 8 p.m. U.S. Central Time, coming up Saturday evening. Uh, of course, Saturday evening is also a celebration for us here on my channel, uh, twitch.tv slash servitalmyk, right there. You guys can see it. You guys can see it. And I'll post it down there in the link below. Um, <clears throat> 24 hours. We are going to be going for 24 hours in celebration of 5,700 followers over on the Twitch channel. Now, um... It's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to have some giveaways with the ship. If you guys don't know what World of Warships is or anything about it, just come on over. And if I can't tell you, then I can find some people who have the right answers. So either way, boys, thank you very much for watching the videos. Like, follow, subscribe down below, and we'll see y'all later on this evening. Salute, boys. Let's go. Let's get them. Day 23. No smokes. We'll fight off the cigarette. <clears throat> Oh, 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 no smoking.